everyone and welcome to another live protocol video this time around I'm gonna be talking about pets I am a proud pet owner I have a Labrador retriever and as I see it I I realize how kind of wrong it sounds that you see that you own a pet but that's the way it is described so that's the way I'm gonna address it anyway I thought it would be interesting to talk about uh, the effects that they have on our lives how they improve our lives how they re reduce our anxiety they increase our physical activity because we have to take them out we have to play with them all that stuff they give us companionship and they even help us in workplaces like uh, uh, therapy dogs helping in healthcare centers uh, police dogs you know the, they do a lot for us and deserve and they deserve a lot of recognition so without further ado I hope you guys enjoyed the video let's go with how pets improve our lives <laughs> How Pets Improve Our Lives Pets are widely perceived to bring physiological and psychological benefits to their caregivers. They play various health-promoting roles, especially for individuals lacking familial support. Add to that the recent COVID-19 pandemic, and we see people reaching out to buy these furry little creatures to snuggle with during these trying times. Thanks to evolution, domesticated animals have become attuned to human behavior. They possess the capability, albeit very limited, to understand certain words we use. They can also detect changes in our body language and tone of voice, according to which, they adjust their behavior. Some benefits that pets come with include Reducing anxiety and providing stress relief Studies have shown that people with pets, are less likely to suffer from anxiety and depression, as compared to their non-pet counterparts. The sensory acts of hugging and touching an affectionate animal, can immediately prompt a calming feeling, where you were otherwise stressed. Engaging in playful activities with animals, provide a much needed diversion from other stress-inducing areas of your life, thereby, increasing the production of dopamine and serotonin, which elevates your mood. Petting an animal also has therapeutic effects. The simple act of stroking an animal, has shown to reduce high blood pressure and hypertension. Even hardened criminals, exhibit changes in their aggressive characteristics over time, when they experience mutual affection from an animal for the first time. If you're liking the video, please leave a like and consider subscribing. Let's get going. Increase in physical activity. Taking your pet for a walk regularly, is vitally important in some cases. Even if walking them is not necessary, they make great walk buddies, and you can still take them with you instead of going for a boring walk all alone. Going on a walk with your little friend, means you get your daily step count and exercise in. This not only provides an opportunity to connect with nature and clear your mind, but also helps you get your much needed physical activity checked off the to-do list. According to a study, the average walking time for people went up at least 30 minutes, when they bought a pet. Due to increased physical activity and the calming effects pets can have, pet owners also exhibit lower levels of cholesterol. Elderly pet owners were shown to make 30% fewer doctor visits as compared to those with no pets. Providing companionship Humans have a basic need for companionship. Animals fulfill that by being great friends. They live in the moment, not reminiscing on the past or worrying about the future. This makes them much more forgiving of us. This, in turn, makes us more mindful and live life as it comes. They offer comfort and support when the world can seem overwhelming. Their loving companionship can ease the notion of loneliness and isolation, which alleviates feelings of depression and self-pity. Children's Physical and Emotional Development The advantages of having pets are not limited to adults. Studies found that children with autism or learning difficulties, were better able to connect with animals than with human beings. Connecting with an animal helped them building interactions with people as well. Animals don't represent an authoritative figure for children like their elders do. Pets do not give orders or expect something of you. Their love is not conditional, all they want to do is play. For kids, this can bring about a sense of easiness associated with pets. It helps them grow up to be more active and secure. This also teaches them empathy and care for living creatures from an early age. Benefits of Pets in the Workplace Apart from bringing sentimental value, pets, especially dogs, help us out in a number of professional areas. Dogs are easily trainable and have an extraordinary sense of smell. They can aid in a range of activities. For example, rescue dogs can search for survivors after natural disasters, 
and save thousands of people around the world every year. They can also assist in tracking illegal substances and detecting different medical conditions, such as diabetes, cancer, etc. Therapy dogs are employed in nursing homes and care centers to aid patients suffering from physical or mental disabilities. However, a pet doesn't necessarily have to be a cat or a dog. Having a pet can be as simple as watching a tiny fish roam around in the aquarium. It could be a rabbit, full of energy and low maintenance. It could be a reptile, like a snake or a lizard, if you're allergic to furry animals. It can also be a long-term companion like a parrot, especially if you want someone that can swear at your guests when you can't. There are multiple ways pets can help our lives in meaningful ways, so make sure to treat your little companion with love and respect. It's not about what they can do for us, it's about what we can do for each other. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please consider leaving a like and subscribing, that will allow us to keep making more videos like this. For more related content please click on one of the suggested videos. Thank you for watching.